Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope everyone's well and good. Right, what were we up to? I can't remember. I'm sure I was busy doing something. Or was I not? Hmm. Were we not wrapping bales? Oh no. Hasn't saved, has it? Has it? No, I left that in the hedges, didn't I? Ah, oh, balls. Oh, no. Well, that's rubbish. I thought I did. I wrapped some bales and I didn't pick them up, did I? So where? Uh, what field were we were cutting? Twenty eight. Oh no. Ah no, we're good. We're good. Okay. So, oh, jobs are good. Right, Jesus. Hey Dean, how are you doing? Uh, if everyone from Twitch and YouTube can let us know that the chat's actually working, that would be great. I've only got three or four comments from YouTube at the moment. Hey Jackson, how are you doing? Yeah, we did two jobs worth. Yeah, 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 right. You are right. So, if we pause this now then, and we go to... Uh, not that one. That one. So, I don't know whether we should try and buy field, buy, buy that field, because we own 28.27, which is, oh, 27. Hmm. So we could go more 27. What could I do with it, though? Hmm, no, I, I was thinking more, maybe it's a bit of harvesting. Uh, so I've got field six. Uh, didn't we own a field? Ah, field 41. Yeah, we own that. So that's planted. So, oh, so before that grows, we need to do... Uh, we need to go and fert it. That's what we need to do. We need to fert. Hey, so remembering what the hell I had to do, man. Uh, so we need a fertiliser. So we'll buy that. And then we need... I may as well just fill the fert up while I'm there. Uh, so it's not, it's for bags in it. Yeah, so it's, it's this I need. Right, that's fine. Uh, I'm doing good, everyone. How are you? Yeah, absolutely spot on, guys. Yeah, got back from my dad. Finally got me, uh, my dad's thing built. Uh, so, which I'm really, really... I couldn't really talk about, obviously, before I left because I was trying to keep it as a surprise. Oh, we'll take the, take the deer, John. Eh? Afternoon, Nathan. How are we doing? Right, so I think it's a, it's a, it's a right for this shop, isn't it? Hey, Top Gear, how are we doing? How's everyone else doing? Hope you're all well. Yeah, I'm really pleased with it, Paul. I'm, I'm really pleased to get it done for him, you know. Like, it's been a long time in the making. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm chuffed a bit for him, like, I really am. Couldn't be happier. He might be watching, so... If you are, Dad, cheers to your new rig. Hope you love it. Right, so... I think it's down here, left and left again, I think. I think that's where we are. Yeah, we're trucking after this. Uh, and I'll be drifting sometime this week. Uh, I've got a, a new wheel rim that I'm go going to be ordering at some point. So, as soon as I've ordered that, we'll be drifting because I want to try it out. Monkey London's offered me onto his server as much as I want. So, yeah, I want to really get back into that. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? It is. No, it really is nice. 
I've got a whole load of stuff coming for my rig. <coughs> so, quite looking forward to that as well. Just, just some bolt on bits, just tidy it up a little bit. So, when am I doing a full episode of building trucks? Uh, not today. Well, I suppose I could actually. Because I haven't really got the time to do like a two or three hour episode. So, I could do a, I could do an hour and a half on truck sim today. Just building, building trucks if you want. But I know people like driving, you know. Yeah, big fella, yeah. Chuffed a bitch for him, man. He deserves it. He helps out a lot. A lot of people think we don't do much, but he, he does help out a lot. Like, uh, what? Have I got a button on here to refill? I don't think we do. No, so ours refill. There we go. Good afternoon, uh, are you James Bates? <laughs> how are you doing? Uh, John, how are you doing over on Twitch? Hope you're well, buddy. Yeah, we're smashing Twitch at the minute, man. Twitch is going down well. 1,300 followers on Twitch. It's not a lot to some people, but Jesus, I think we're doing all right. Uh, I may as well just fill this bad boy up. Nice looking tractor that, isn't it? Come on. Ooh, I might need a front weight on this. <laughs> Do you think I need a weight? She's uh Yeah, I think we need I think we need to buy ourselves a weight while we're here. She's sagging a bit. <laughs> Happens with old age that does. Uh ooh, John Deere weights. Uh I mean it's a big tractor, so we'll go for a big weight. Right, so I can shut the top of that now. Excellent. Uh, that's a lot for a couple of weeks. Great progress. I know, it's alright, isn't it? I right, just remembered uh, the white listing goes live. Yeah, I don't know what time we're going live today, white listing, but it is today. Right, has that straightened me up a little bit, that? Oh, wow. Look at the difference. Like it. You'll do for me. Uh, top, I've just seen Top Gear's message there. Yeah, Top Gear, them pedal plates that you found on eBay for me. I have always wanted them, but at the moment, for the cost, I just, I can't. Uh, so, yeah, I appreciate you sending me the link, but... One of the other things I've got for both the rigs, I, I'll be, uh, I've got this, like, piping to go in, which I'm, I'm looking forward to do a bit of a refresh on both rigs, and then I'm going to review a pair of them, because uh, a lot of people have been asking questions between each rig and that could really do with uh, doing a review on them like 100% so I will be doing that shortly right so we need to be into field 28 I think that's around the back of the sheeps isn't it the sheeps we'll go around the back of the sheeps Hey, Alexander. Uh, <laughs> Alexander, how are you doing? My speech today is horrendous. Hey, Praz, how are you doing? Mr. Lee, oh, how's it going? Yeah. Top man, how are you doing today, Mr. Lee? Hope you're well. I think it's about time we gave this John Deere a bath. It, it needs it. There was supposed to be a message attached to it. Well, you did it wrong, mate. You did it wrong. Well, just blame you, mate. I'm sure you did something wrong.
Right, I'll give this a quick bath. I was meant to say, Discord launch day. <laughs> well, you failed, didn't you? To be to be fairly, the uh, the Streamlabs side of it's normally better. Like it, it does. I don't know why, but the super chat seems really like sometimes things work, sometimes they don't. Uh, ben Williams, yeah, it'll be a test night tonight. Uh, obviously, we won't have many people on, I don't think. But yeah, Discord will be open to all the regulars tonight. Uh, sorry. The server will be open to all the regulars, and if we need to, we can start adding a few people in. Yeah, because I think we're doing the official wipe on Thursday, I think, was the plan. I can't remember exactly, but I think the wipe of every character is Thursday. And even the admin will need to grind for the money, so... gonna double check something here so got weeds on auto saves on don't need lime yeah that can stay on I can't see if I've actually furted that why is that why is that a thing uh, So why isn't that coming up as being furted? Can you not furt grass fields? Ah, possibly can't actually furt that. It's all right, cause I need to go and fur at 42 anyway, so I'll save me fur and we'll go and fur at 42. Ah, is that because it's a cow field? Right, that's fine. The day's going all right, mate. It's going, I'm, I can't, obviously can't complain. I need to decide what we're doing, uh, what we're doing for the next stream. I was going to go trucking, but I've got a couple of people asking me to do some build-only truck streams. So like one or two a month, and just do a, 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 a like an hour and a half stream, and uh, and just build trucks. So build a load of different trucks, so you guys can see kind of the mods I use and stuff. So uh, I don't know whether to do that today. Right, that, 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 that's working. So that's good. Hey, right, uh, where else are we? Yeah, tonight, Brandon. Tonight, tomorrow, Wednesday, and then Thursday, Friday. It'll be probably some cleaning up, and then we'll go live on the Friday. So. I'm not doing GTA next. I'll be GTA 11, so no. Right, uh, you're currently sitting in college waiting for the bus. Oh, well, have you had a good day, mate? I hope you have. Yeah, we just got some... Uh, we're, we're currently sitting in a field uh, doing a bit of furting. Bit of, bit of good old furting. Right, uh, you're going to have to schedule... What's that, Nathan? I'm not sure what you mean there. Uh, 
Right, uh, are you quick? How are you doing? Oh, Red Dead? I don't have Red Dead, mate, so... Yeah, I don't, don't imagine we'll be playing it. Right, I want a wheel so bad. You can get a second-hand wheel for good money, mate. Hang on, I need to see where I'm going here. Right, I missed a bit there. I need to really straighten up here. I'll turn it off on the way back down, and then we'll uh, we'll do a straight line the way back up because I'm, I'm going a bit wonky here. Oh yeah, capture. How are you doing? What's the player base looking like? Uh, I'm not sure what you mean there, Hintiggy. Well, how many have we got to go live with? Uh, like seven. Yeah, it'll be a, it'll be a quiet start, like. You're getting your first wheel tonight, you're excited. Awesome mate. What are you going for? What are you getting? Are you a fire fight? How we doing? How we doing? Hope you're well. Yeah, well I got my uncle Sean coming around this afternoon, so possibly. Uh, or some point. So big shout out to everyone over the weekend for all the help. Thank you for that. I've uh, neat clear nearly half of what I uh or the big man, so. Sean's been a big help to the, to me, so I, I can only thank everyone for the help, you know. Right, uh, oh mate, I'm great. I'm really good. Chuffed a bit to my dad. He seemed to have an okay race last night, so first race on his rig. He'll have loads of tweaking to do. Uh, unfortunately, that's part of having rigs, you know. Right, so I don't know whether to go grass cutting next or go and do a bit of uh, a bit of. Cause I need to feed me cows today, but I'm going to do that at the end of the day. So, should we go grass cutting or should we go harvesting? Right, you and Kyle, how are you doing, buddy? Hope you're well. Good. Right, take the dear John back to the farm. We need to decide what we're doing. Right, let's go and cut some grass. Uh, what else? Who else is going to decide? Uh, Evan, mate, just go and watch the last couple of streams, buddy. But yeah, uh, what do you want to do? Grass or harvesting? I'll let you guys pick. I need to do both, so it doesn't matter which one I do. Which one do you want to watch today? Grass cutting, harvest. Pick one. It's hard with this farm, because it's a grass oriented farm, so... Hiya Richard White, how you doing buddy? Hope you're well. Right, so I've got one in for grass and one in for combine, okay. It's a draw. Two in for grass. Two in for <laughs> combine. <laughs> Anything harvesting is relaxing, same with grass. I know, I wanted you guys to pick, so I've got grass, 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 harvesting, harvesting, harvesting. Uh, I've technically got... We'll just do grass. Cheers, Unicoil, for the host. May as well. I'll start and get a complex. <laughs> Right, uh, so I need my mowers, which I need that John Deere for, because that's my mowing tractor. Right, I did watch the stream. Uh, do watch you. Uh, just I was late, so I didn't know. 
Well, obviously you know he got his new rig. Your question was, did your dad get his new rig? Well, yes, he did. And it is fully set up and finished, so. Right. Sorry, I've got like so many emails to catch up on. I'm kind of like replying to emails as I go. I actually got a really interesting email the other day, which I can't talk about. So I don't know why I'm telling you, but I'll be able to talk about it soon. Ah, uh, hi you, uh, Harry. How are you doing, buddy? Hope you're well. Yeah, we're just going to pick up the moors, which I think are down in this shed next to my 143 Scania. I think. Are they? Uh, did I put the rear one in first? No, rear one's in last. Excellent. Uh, network, I'm not sure what you mean, buddy. I'm, I'm not 100% what you mean by that, sorry. Right, I need to fold that bad boy up, which is that one. There we go. Right, so I need to get to field 28. Ah, capture. Yeah. What? I mean, to be honest, though, capture. If you're gonna, if you are gonna go down that route, I, I would highly recommend before you do anything major, get a rig. <laughs> Honestly. Right, triple zero. It does make a difference. Don't get me wrong, but Caps brand new to, the, to to everything, and with the way that he's going, he's going to end up with a rig anyway. So I would recommend him getting a rig uh, and then going down that route. But if you're looking at a triple stand, obviously three screens and a triple stand will cost you about the same as what a rig would. To be fair. How the hell do I get into this field? Ah, there's the gate. Got ya. Got ya, gate. Bank manager being me. <laughs> I was gonna say, aren't you self employed? probably could to be honest some of the things that some of my friends have wrote off over the years have been hilarious <coughs> all right uh, I'm doing good C CST how are you doing how's the channel going actually I've just, I've just realized who you are how's the channel going buddy hope you hope you're well hope everything's going well for you as well All 
Right, hiya Freddy, how are you buddy? Hope you're well. Yeah, enjoying a bit of farming mate. I've actually been really enjoying the farming. <coughs> kind of really happy with the way that the streams are all looking. I'm happy, like, I'm really comfortable, I get to use my chair and all that. <coughs> so, I do really like being on here, like. Hello, Arn, how are you doing? Hope you're well. Oh, I need to be going down here. Some of the bushes, right, you can't see where you're going. Right, so now we need to rotate back round like this, and then we need to drive in our. We need to drive where we could. There we go. Nailed it. All right, uh, I'm gonna do some work. No, you're not. That's a lie. He's gonna go and sit on Snapchat or something for a bit. It's amazing, like. You get used to lying so much, and pretending that you work. Go on, Lee, you go and do some Snapchat, mate. Enjoy. No point starting now. Nice one, firefight. Love it. I just realised you were on. Oh yeah, you don't work some days, do you? I don't matter. I was going to say something there, but I was I was wrong. Afternoon, Mr. Graham. How we doing? How are you doing, buddy? Oh, Graham, right? You have dogs, don't you? I'm pretty sure you've got dogs. Uh, answer me the question. Do you have dogs or not? Or do you have, like... Does your rig get really dusty? And off your feet you, all the dog hair or animal hair gets in all the channels on your rig answer me that yes or no I reckon we'll do one more cut uh, I'm here too five today so I best do something <laughs> ah, at least you didn't say work this time I like it I like it at least you didn't say work right so go on the sim labs website go to accessories and go to page three they've started selling the uh, the the trim for the uh, for the grooves in your rig so it's like a I think it's like a rubbery plastic it comes in all different colors it comes in two meter lengths and you slide it in the channel on top of your rig and then things can't fall into it it, it might not be understanding what I'm saying, but I've ordered some, so if you want to wait until mine comes, but honestly, they've only just started selling it, and it, uh, it's really, really good, because some of my friends have had it in the past. So yeah, you can put it in where your pedals are, you can put it in all, all down the top of the channels where it fills up the hair, and then uh, when you're hoovering it, there's no hair goes in the channels, you can just hoover around it. It's brilliant. Ah, you're a 20 year staffy father. Got you there, mate. Got you there. I miss my boy. I do. Might, might, possibly might be getting another dog. Not, not on purpose. Right, we need to decide about uh, going a different route now. Right, no more for me, hats. Oh, definitely skin, yeah. Completely, mate, it does. I mean, I, ours wouldn't have been, I, I'm not I'm, just, I'm not saying it wouldn't have been as bad, because that, that's, that's a lie, but it, it, it honestly wouldn't have been as bad if the dog was was older. With him only being five, it, 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 it was, you know, it was quite hard. Uh, so... Yeah, that definitely hurt more with him only being like five. So, but no, it was up with my dad's and one of his neighbours is not very well and he had a rescue dog uh, and he's in hospital. 
And obviously we don't know what's going to happen. He's an older gentleman, so if it's a point where the dog needs to go back into care, uh, I just I said to I said to the guy who's currently looking after him. I said, look, we'll we'll just take him. I can't see a dog go back into a, in, into a home when George would benefit to having another one, you know. That afternoon, uh, keep the good work with the videos, seeing you build. It was good, eh? It, I really enjoyed it. Right, we've got 131 opinions in chat, so complete people, please let me know what you want to see at about 4 o'clock. I was going to go trucking, but I've got a few people asking me to, to go on Euro Truck and do some truck builds. So literally just do a stream of building like man trucks, Mercedes, you know, building just tons of different trucks with all the mods I've got. So just do like an hour and a half of truck building. Do you want to see that today or should I do that another day? Please let me know what you want to see. It's either that or I go truck driving. I'm not bothered either way. Right, I was just straightening that off a bit. The only thing with this is, I keep not tightening it up enough, and I've got it on my mouse pad, so it doesn't grip well. Right, Sims 4, only George. I'm not playing Sims 4, George. You're hilarious, now leave. <laughs> right, truck builds, truck builds will be good. I do some ideas for my trucks. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, we can do truck builds, I'm more than happy with that. Right, is this. Have we got a square field yet? Right, so I reckon if we go straight down here. Try to square this off a bit because it's, uh, it's not the squarest field in the world. Uh, T TSM. So currently it's half past uh, two. So an hour and a half, four o'clock. I'll probably end this stream around about uh, quarter two so I can jump straight off, fire my rig up because my rig's not even turned on. So More drifting on the set of Corsa or Forza. That would be nice. Completely agree. Coming soon. Temple. As soon as I, honestly, I, I will be drifting uh, very shortly. I've got, I've had a few things to do within the pipeline, uh, including my hands again, but that's purely because I didn't have any coils. Luckily, I had a great weekend, managed to order some coils, so they'll be here this week. Uh, and then, cause I, I have ordered some, but I'm going, I've got to reclaim the, big an order through Amazon because it never turned up. Anyway, so yeah, I'm going to order a new wheel this week. So, I just, I can't drift with gloves on. It just feels, well I can, but it just feels like you're trying to drift with friggin' oven mitts on, man, I hate it. And then if you drift without gloves, you just burn your hands because my wheels weird. Right, are you playing with money mod or without? Without, mate. Yeah, without. Just, just grinding, mate. Yeah. I haven't yet, David, no. I haven't, because obviously I've been away, mate, so... Yeah, I've been away. You're not the only one to love the drifting streams, no. No, I've got, uh, Hang on, I'll be able to show you. Right, so the wheel that I currently use at the moment is uh, is a suede wheel. Basically, when you let go, the wheel spins. You burn your hands, so you should use glass. Uh, glass? Gloves. I don't like using gloves. So, I've had my eyes on this one for a while. Uh, I don't know if you'll be able to actually see, but... Yeah, for anyone interested in drifting and that, that's what I'm going to... That's the Vertex wheel I'm going to order. 
they're down to 37 quid at the moment on eBay so if you are interested in drifting and that and you've got like a Thrustmaster wheel go and get yourself one 37 quid just type Vertex steam wheel and eBay they're down from 50 so they're, they're well worth it uh, they are full leather so if, if you're someone that wants a leather wheel I, I would go and get it Right, have you ever done uh, a raced out truck or planning on it? A raced out truck? Uh, I don't know what you mean there, what, like a chavy truck? Is that what you mean? I don't know if you could really do one, because... Yeah, I don't think you could. Right, what's my advice on a bucket seat for a larger person? Uh, measurements. It depends how large you are, because it doesn't matter how large on the front you are. Like, if you're a big guy, uh, but you're out to here but you're still only like a 36 inch waist well you'll be able to get in more seats uh, my dad's seat's quite a big seat I think my dad'll suit up to about a uh, 38 inch to a 40 inch waist but then obviously it doesn't matter how big you are on the front it's purely your hip measurements so you could be literally 12 foot wide on the front it doesn't matter it's only your hip measurements and your shoulder measurements that matter when you're buying a bucket seat it's the only bits that matter <laughs> right, um, you're a 52 inch waist, right, okay, so you're a, you're a big guy then. Uh, but what I mean is, so you're a 52 inch waist in trouser, right, which is which is fine. But like someone like me dad, when me, me dad lost a lot of weight, but me dad used to be a 38 inch waist, right, but then his tummy would overhang his waist, right. So if you'd have put his trousers around his waist, he probably would have been like a 44, something like that. What I'm saying is, you need to forget about this bit, so your trousers go around here. Forget about that, all you need to know is, from hip to hip, it's your width. It's literally, so, it, you just need to measure from here to here, not around your tummy. So, put your tape measure in front of your tummy and measure your hip. That's the bit that sits in the seat, all this doesn't matter. I know it sounds ridiculous, but I, I'm talking the truth. Afternoon, Dom, how we doing, how we doing? Hope you're well, my friend. Hips don't lie. No, but what I'm saying is, round your wit, yeah, honestly. If you're that stuck, go to a bucket seat store and ask, but you obviously fit in a car, so, you know, you could, it's simple things like car seats, you can measure, measure the, the bottom of the car seat width to find out what width of uh, bucket seat you would need. But if you can sit in a car, then obviously you can buy a, you can buy a seat that would fit you. Uh, where else are we? Hello, top gamers. How are you doing, buddy? Yep, just doing a bit of uh, a bit of grass cutting. Right, where else are we? Did I see Mitch in? Hiya, Mitch. How are you doing? Afternoon, my buddy. How's life treating you? Uh, yeah, we'll be on testing tonight, definitely. Right, how do I sign up? So once the Discord goes live, I'll be putting it in my videos. It's not actually live currently, but it's going live. Right, you're interested in a new grid? Uh, oh, definitely, yeah, uh, definitely. I did have the chance to review it, but I'm just not a very good video editor. Uh, I mean, if I had someone like my dad closer, uh, if you you know, and you could come round and use these computers and actually uh, edit things for me, uh, that that would be brilliant. My dad, you know, he's not got the mental capacity now. To be, don't get me wrong, but I, I know if he had the time and he was chilled, he could definitely do stuff like that for us. And uh, and he's very good at stuff like that. Like when he puts his mind to something, he's 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 really really good.
Right, so question is, do we do we go on and cut should we just go and cut twenty seven as well? We probably should just jump through and cut twenty seven because we're in twenty eight now, so where's twenty seven now? It's twenty seven through here. I think it is. I may as well just go and cut twenty seven as well. Ah, uh, yeah, no, Sim, uh, S Sim. We're just really enjoying the uh, I racing at the moment, you know. are on, let's go. Uh, where else are we? Yeah, so I'll do both fields and then I'll, <coughs> I'll probably do one silage bales and one normal bales because uh, we can take them and sell them and we've only got 29 grand in the bank so yeah. <laughs> Hello Road Valley, how are you doing buddy? Hope you're well. Hope you're having a good day mate, hope you're having a good day. Mark, uh, do the, I'm doing really good. Yeah, we're going to do a truck building uh, stream today, so we're not going to do any driving in Euro Truck today. We're going to do a truck building stream. Might not go down well, but we're just going to buy a truck, build it, buy another truck, build it, and just build as many trucks as we can. And then we'll, you, we'll possibly go driving in them next time. It'll be pretty cool. Yep, awesome blade, got you there. Now you're getting some TCR practice uh, so I can take. Yeah, definitely, yeah. I don't think my dad's on tonight. I think he's uh, he's having a bit of a break for everything. He he, he did help me over the weekend and he and he did hurt himself. So Not hurt himself, but he, he's hurt anyway. So. Uh, but he did make things a little bit worse. So Yeah, I think he might be off for a day or two. We'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. It could be on a bit more. I don't know. Uh, we can. Uh, uh, have I got a K100? Yeah, I've got a K100. Yeah, yeah. We can buy whatever chuck mods you want. Uh, I can only use what I've got in. I don't have enough time today to download more mods. But yeah, yeah. For something we're desperately missing, I can always download that on stream. I don't. It doesn't bother me. Oh, this is a fairly square field, this anyway. Looks like, oh, he did, Sam, I know. Don't think I've seen him look that happy for a long time, to be honest. We ordered him some new bits for his rig as well. So, uh, <coughs> yeah, they, quite a lot, actually, when it came to it. But, yeah, we went on the uh, SimLab's website with him. Uh, he got a couple of bits of extra profile in case in case he wants to add something. He got a couple of uh, brackets and things as well. Uh, he got a cup holder. Uh, what else did he get? He got, he got a couple of little bits. He, all together it came for like $300. Uh, sorry, 300 euro. But obviously I think about 210 euro that was me. Uh, got some new bits coming for my Evo. So currently my Evo I'm gonna make into more of a trucking rig. Well one of the one of the issues is I took the gear stick mount off my GT1 Evo 
and put it on my other rig so I could run my sequential shifter you see uh, but the the gear mount that I made for the Evo was off my dad's monitor stand well obviously it was my monitor stand that I kept but I took the, I took the uh, where we are, yeah, we go. yeah so I, I took a bit off it so I could make a gearbox mount so my Evo doesn't have a, a gearbox mount on it at the moment got my dad some wheels ordered as well for his rig so it's pretty cool Right, it was good to catch up with you two again, sorry. Oh, mate, it's, you know, it was horrible weather as well. It's not like I could stand outside and have a bit of a chat and a smoke to you. It was, it was terrible. It was, the weather was horrendous. So, right, going back, uh, be watching on TV, Mark. Thank you, still streaming on YouTube. Oh, absolutely, David, absolutely. I mean, David, it's one of them things. Will I still be streaming on YouTube in four years? I don't know. The Twitch quality is better. I, I cannot argue that the Twitch quality is better. But don't forget, if you are watching on a TV, uh, if you've got Amazon Prime, an Amazon Prime Fire Stick, which is like £20, or you've got Google Chrome, uh, sorry, uh, Chromecast or anything like that, you can watch Twitch on a TV. So you can uh, Chromecast it straight to your TV and as I say, it, it, all you need is either Chromecast, a uh, smart telly, an Amazon Fire Stick. Uh, that's what I use to, cro to send things to my telly. So you can watch Twitch on TV, so don't be put off. Hello, Samulation. How we doing, Paul? Hope you're well. Right, I need more formula type wheel. Uh, I only have the standard Forza rim and the 354 drifting. Uh, a bit tricky racing some cars. Yeah, so what 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 are you looking at? I mean, I, I would recommend getting the actual, if you're on Fnatic, I would just get the, uh, the F1 wheel. It's absolutely stunning. Well, Lee Taylor, how are we doing? I'm doing good, man. How are you? Yeah, I actually, I can't complain, but it all, all's good. Had a good drive back down last night. My wife's a bit tired, but yeah, all, all's going well. Texting and drive. I know, mate, it's, uh, it's one of the companies that I'm dealing with that I'm uh, texting. Well, I'm not texting, I'm emailing. Ah, PS4 you can watch on Twitch. Oh, I think, I think Xbox you can as well. Right, nearly done. Go and get the road up machine out, boys. Nice square up turn. Uh, yeah, cheers, mate. I just buy, honestly, Fnatic F1 wheel, it's not, I mean it's expensive but it's not like, it's not massive, massive money, so that's the one I would go with. I've got the hub, I've got smaller F1 style of rims, it's nowhere near as nice. Uh, I've also got the McLaren wheel which, again, it's the cheapest wheel, it is lovely, the McLaren wheel is very nice, but the F1 wheel is better made, 100%. Uh, 
I know I didn't know whether to make some more here in this field, but I'll do a bit more bale wrapping first because I can get money for that. It's the money that we need at the moment. Hey Jack, how are you doing? I hope you're well, buddy. Hope you're keeping all right, mate. I really do. I just sent your dad some pics. Uh, pics of what, mate? What you been doing? Where's my pictures? If Kelly's on it, I definitely I'll, I'll take a picture. Hundred percent. Right, decorating the lads' of their bedroom, we'll send you... Oh, right, 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 got you there. Ah, he's got a nice little setup, that little lad. He definitely, definitely has. Looks really, really good. Luke Lyons, how are you doing, buddy? Yeah, we just, uh, I'm going to... So what I'm going to do is finish cutting this field. I'm going to nip back, grab the uh, wind raw, uh, and then bring the wind roll back up to field 28 and then I'm going to nip downstairs and throw the dog outside quickly and then I'll be back on I've been told to check my phone oh wow yeah that looks cool man what a guy I like that Yeah, that's quite nice, that mate. It's quite out there. I like it. Right, I'll be docking you for texting on my cut. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, the next couple of days, unfortunately, well, mainly today, I'll be on the phone quite a bit because I need to get caught up with shit. Unfortunately. The thing is, if I wasn't live, when you email them people, it takes ages for them to get back, but as soon as I'm live and I, and I email someone, they get back to me within like five seconds. Ridiculous. Right, would I, I 735-70k a bottleneck at 1060? Right. You've got to understand what bottlenecking is, right? It, I mean, it wouldn't severely bottleneck. It wouldn't physically stop the thing working. Would you lose some performance putting an i5 37, uh, 3570k in over, say, an 8700k? Yes, the 8700k would give you more frame rates. But can you afford a, a, an 8700k? No. So, what, see, what people forget is, technically, like my big computer is bottlenecked by 1080 Ti. Technically, because the i9 would benefit having a 2080 Ti in, I would gain more frame rates. But it's not bottlenecked, it runs brilliantly. It's the same as like, it's the same as anything. You're gonna, there's always gonna be a better upgrade. Uh, you'd only really bottleneck something hard if you like, I don't know, put like say a 2080 Ti in with like an i3. Then yeah, you're not gonna get much performance. <laughs> you know, but it would still work, so at the end of the day so if, if a 37 if 3570k is all you can afford it will do you absolutely fine with a 1060 right finally bought breakfast uh, gonna get stuck in on that yeah Wednesday of that mate yeah Wednesday Right, when the green tape come off will be white. Uh, the paint scheme that I was going to use in my game frame. Ah, I got you. That's oh, good, man. I, I hope he loves it. It looks pretty cool, man. It does look pretty cool. I like that. Right, dive back to the farm. Uh, should we use... We'll probably use the uh, the new Holland for the wind run. So I can just leave this with the mowers on. Uh, Aaron, I've done my fair share of multiplayer over the years. And 
it always just gets really bloody complicated. If I was just a one stream a day kind of guy, and I was I could just do one time a day, then yes, uh, I I definitely could whole multiplayer and I could probably have it really running really well on one game but again I've got so many games that I play uh, it just gets ruined if I try you know try and do multiplayer on truck and multiplayer on farm and multiplayer on race and multiplayer on wreckfest multiplayer on 5m it's like there's all these different communities and just yeah it just it just becomes hard work to be honest Uh, I do get sick of farming, that's why I stopped playing it for six or seven months, I think. Yeah. But no, I'm loving it again now. I mean, a lot more mods and things out now, to be fair. All right, afternoon, Stuart. How are you doing? Ah, my dad used to play that sniper game, you know. Uh, Aaron, I don't. It doesn't really bother me what map I play on, as long as I enjoy the actual map. Uh, yeah, it doesn't, doesn't really bother me. Uh, oh, field here, isn't it? Right, just building a new farm behind the scenes. Uh, oh, nice one, man! What you what 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 like a new map? You mean, or you building a new farm for your multiplayer? Is that what you mean? Uh, Aaron, the last two days been fine. Still recovering a little bit off last week, but last week I wasn't. I was uh, yeah in a bit of a bad way. A couple of bad days, to be honest. So. Uh, is Luke seeing? I didn't even see him creep in. All right, Luke, creeped in there, you creeper. How are you doing, mate? I hope you're well. Yeah, I'm just going to be nipping downstairs to let the dog out. I'm just going to do a run around the outside, and then I'm going to nip out two minutes. So, apologies, but the uh, dog needs to pee in that. All right, how come you stream on other platforms, but you never read? Which I've seen people comment in your stream, but you never really take any notice. Uh, it's just not true, to be honest. I try and read both as much as I can. I mean, if anything, I would say I miss more YouTube chat than I do Twitch. Uh, I, I do try. Again, if you're talking about someone saying hi, if eight people come in and say hello, I generally read one or two. Because if it's all within five seconds, I'm not going to read hi eight times or if people are going how are you doing I'm not going to answer how am I doing eight times from eight different people in you know so what I do is I try and space that out a little bit but yeah to say that I don't read Twitch chat is to be honest I would say it's a lie because I, I generally do but I definitely would say factually I miss more YouTube chat than what I do Twitch because there just isn't that much Twitch chat there's 20 people watching you know I don't, I don't miss that much I think I, I also just to sheep, you know, I can't read your full name out either. So if I've missed any of your comments, it's more than likely your name because obviously it's not PG. So I cannot really read it out. I see, yeah, completely agree. Yeah, one up on you. Yeah. I, I do try, mate, but as I say, some days it gets a bit mad. Uh, some days with the YouTube it jumps in like groups of 10 so I do miss that you know oh <laughs> right okay sheep so one you're not a regular so you've literally just spouted complete rubbish two you 
yeah, obviously uh, yesterday we didn't have Twitch chat because Restream was broken, so we didn't read any Twitch chat yesterday because Restream was broken. Uh, so yeah, and I didn't read any chat because I was obviously building my dad's rig, so. But anyway, hope you're well, mate. Welcome to the chat. Yeah, so if you've been in my stream for 30 minutes, you'll see that I've been reading out Road Rally's chat, who is obviously on Twitch, so. So it's fine mate, if you're going to comment, just, you know, try and keep it factually good, you know. Alright, uh, I'm planning to see natural growth, see... <laughs> what are you on about, Philip? What's happening? Alright, real Carl, how are you doing, mate? Oh, you've not put a downer on me, mate. I'm married, mate. I'm down all the time. Right, I'm just going to quickly dip downstairs and sort the dog out. I'll be literally five minutes.
Sorry about that. Dog was being a knob. <coughs> Alright, let's go. Alright, there we are. Alright, let's get turned around. Starting to get dark, isn't it? Let's uh, put our lights. Let's put our lights on. There we go. Oh, there we go. All right, hey Jake, how are you doing, buddy? Hope you're well. Right, a uh, bit of truck building. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to do a truck building stream uh, after this, yeah. So, we'll probably go on to about quarter to four. Because uh, I'm slightly run out of time today, obviously. I've had a busy weekend, though, so... I have had a, a busy weekend. Yeah, no driving today, no. It'll just be a truck building stream. That's what you guys have asked for, so that's what we're going to do. I like building trucks, like, to be fair, so... Uh, Stretch, thanks for the raid, bud. Hope you're having a good one. Hope you're keeping well. Alright, how's the farm? Farm's going... She's going alright, mate. Yeah, I'm just uh, contemplating whether to fast-forward the time or not. Uh, I think we should probably fast-forward the time a bit, because it's starting to get a bit dark. Uh, I haven't spoke to my dad today. He's struggling a bit with pain, like so. Uh, he did. He did have to help me with a few bits uh, yesterday. So, yeah, he's struggling a bit, like so. I'll speak to him later today. Uh, and let you know how he's feeling, but I, I don't think he'll be on tonight. I, I can't see it. Uh, I, I just, I can't see it. But we'll see. Right, uh, you love truck building. Well, we'll see. We'll see. It's just going to be a truck building stream, so. Alright. I might have to just do this bit on the outside because you can't see that much, you know. Too much in the dark on this game. All right. I, I'm enjoying the farm sim, lads. I really am. It's good fun, man. I'm pleased I just gave it another crack. Yeah, I am actually really enjoying it. Hey Rob Owen Dog, how are you doing? I'm doing good man, how are you? Alright, let's get cracked. I, can't, I just can't see anything man. So these lines might be a bit rough. <laughs> so we'll finish this field and then we'll go and park in the other field. I'll go and grab the bailer and that while I can't see anything like so. Yeah. I can't see nothing, man. Uh, 
Alright, uh, it's fine. Uh, I prepare for practice night. You know, I'm on the. Oh, yeah, your wheelchair hockey got you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I've got you. As I say, tonight, so I'm possibly going to change Mondays and that around, uh, but tonight, as I say, it will more than likely be 8 o'clock uh, on the 5M. Oh yeah, we're 8 o'clock on 5M tonight, yeah, so test night will start a bit earlier tonight, so it should be good. Hopefully we get plenty in, but again, we haven't got many people whitelisted at the moment, so the server is quite quiet. Right, so pick this up and go to this into the next field. It's one o'clock in the morning at the moment, so we're getting there with time. Right, we'll leave that there. Now we need to take the bailer up. <laughs> SS, how are you doing? We'll be playing farm sim in a few months. Uh, I think so. I mean, it, it, if everyone's happy with me sticking with single player, yeah. I think so. I'm enjoying the single player. So I've got the the new DLCs coming out for the uh, for the horse, uh, not the horse, for what's it called, the class. The new class DLC is coming. So yeah, I, I think we'll stick at it. Uh, I can't see why not. How much is Farm Sim 19? Uh, I, I actually don't know. I don't know. Two seconds, I got Emma on the text. So, right, daytime, seven o'clock in the morning. Well, what, what do you reckon? Maybe it's eight? We'll go to eight. We'll go to eight o'clock and then we're good. What part of there do you live? So I live in the northeast of England, near a place called uh, Darlington, is where I live. Right, we are bailing boys. Right, I can't wait for yeah, I'm looking forward to it man, it's gonna be a good laugh, isn't it? The class stuff's really really nice. You live in Sheffield, looking awesome pal. Cool cool. Yeah, well, we're gonna bail this and then decide what we're doing with the next field. Uh, so I don't know whether I should do this 
and square up the silage. Uh, I think that might be easier to sell. Uh, mirrors, so basically I've got the graphics, I must have the graphics set to four mirrors, uh, and that's why they're flashing. So that'll be why, uh, so I could come out, go and change it and come back in, but I just keep forgetting. So, I need to go and set it to five mirrors, is what I need to do. Jay Austin, how are you doing buddy? Hope you're well bud. Yeah, I hope you're doing all right, mate. Uh, Craig, honestly, mate, yeah, not bad. Nice to be back. Nice to be back, mate. <coughs> it really is. Uh... Where else are we? What are you playing the day of firefight? Anyway, are you... Oh no, you're working tonight, bollocks. Ah, oh, forget about that. Firefight is mainly going to be on through the day. Which, to be fair, if he is going to be on our server through the day, it'll be handy because you still need coppers and people on through the day as well, so... How did the flight sim show go, Mr. Mr. T? And how are you? Are you still enjoying the VR? Ah, Ghost Recon, yeah. Yeah, I need to give that. A, I need to give that a bash, man. All right, so we can cut the time down now. Can have my lights turned off. Yeah, 19 is better now. Yeah, for a, for a while there, it definitely wasn't. Hang on, hang on, Emma's medication, uh, two seconds. Right, I'm back, so it's my wife's uh, meds. Ugh. Right, let's go. Hi, right, uh, yeah, just unfortunately being live, I've 
got a delivery, so you can't hide that, unfortunately. <coughs> Alright, let's go. So, we'll get this build. I'll probably get the other one road, and then we'll see where we're at time-wise. Turned up. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's true, firefighter. That, that, you're so right there, bud. <laughs> yeah, you're so right, dude. Definitely, man. Yes, uh, 8 o'clock 5M, yeah, 8 o'clock for the 5M. Uh, you guys, for me, uh, I want a big screen to hook up onto my laptop. Uh, so, you want, what, so you want like a, a, a big TV, I would imagine, is what you're going to get. So, if you're going to get a TV, just make sure it is full 1080p, uh, and also you know if you can make sure it's not 4k make sure it's not smart uh, get it with as, as little of the extras as you can because it'll be a better quicker screen so anything you know like the ones I used to use were sharp 40 inch uh, same as what the dad uses but they don't have uh, any smart features in them they don't you know they are just 50 uh, 60 Hertz 1080p is all you want yeah if you want a big screen for gaming you you, you more than likely you'll have to go TV uh, so just make sure you get it without all the extras so you'll actually find they're quite cheap uh, the ones I had were around about 210 pounds so you'll get very little lag then uh, but if you only go and say if you want to go like a big monitor so you, you could go like this this is a 35 inch ultra wide uh, you know which would still be a good upgrade for you it all depends on budget but yeah this is a 35 inch ultra wide and I mean this is a big screen you can see the size of my hand uh, and it's absolutely brilliant for what I do so it all depends you can get a 32 inch if you want so 32 inch is that one up there which is obviously quite big I mean you can't really see because the monitor's in the way but 32 inches is a good option as well uh, but if you want to go bigger than 32 you would have to go TV really so but you're going from a laptop screen so I don't know how big you want to go so yeah just let me know Hound Dog uh, how big are you wanting to go and how much you want to spend ish hi right, Ben King how we doing hi Matt got the Barely, I have, I have got that bailer. I think I haven't used it though. I don't think I've used it. No, I haven't used it yet. All right, trying to work out where where, where the bailing's gone wrong. <laughs> I've bailed some things, I haven't bailed others. Right, I was thinking 32 because bigger, I can't step in my rig anymore. Yes. So, you've got two options. If you're going to go 32, in my opinion, if you've got the money, there's more than more than enough 32 monitors out there. So, I would get a monitor if you're going 32. Uh, if you've got around about the 300 to spend, uh, you could also go for a 35-inch ultra-wide. So, it's not as tall as a 32-inch, but for, for racing, it's beautiful because you get a bit of extra... Uh, on on the, on the width, uh, so you, you you can see a bit more. So so yeah, if it was me and I had to go single screen, I would go 35 inch ultra wide. One of the benefits to a 35 inch ultra wide is 
if you ever wanted to go triple screens, which you never know, never say never, as they say, uh, you can add two 27s, uh, and the 27s are the same height as a 34, uh, 35 inch ultra wide, so exactly the same height, so they line up perfectly. So if it was me and I was going single screen, I would go this ultra wide, that's what I would buy, 100%. Right, if you want to go a biggest monitor, go for a Samsung Ultra Wide. 40, yeah, 49 inch Ultra Wide's are nice, but I don't think you'd be wanting to spend that sort of money. Yeah, yeah, so this is a 35 inch Ultra Wide, right? So this monitor is basically, so it's a 27 inch high monitor, right? So if I put my 27 inch monitor next to it, it's 27 inches to here. So the ultra wide part, you get the extra length. So if I then wanted to go and add a 27 on here, it lines up perfectly. So I can add a 27 on here, it's the same height. So all it is, is a 27 inch monitor, but wider, that's all it is. So 35, <coughs> the 35 inch is a 27 inch monitor, but wider. A 29 inch ultra wide is a 24 inch monitor, but wider. So you can match them up to normal monitors, which is really, really good. Uh, yeah, Joel, yeah, yeah, I started with TVs, but yeah. So with racing, I say much more as I do now. So that is the goal. Yeah, so, right. Just, just to help you out, because Rob's been a, you know, Rob's a guy in a wheelchair that didn't, didn't uh, race at all. He's got really into racing. We've got him a wheel. He's got a rig now, you know. So, right. So, Rob, for you, uh, so basically, your laptop is a 16 by 9 monitor, right? So, 16 by 9 is, so your 16 by 9 would be around about this here. So, you would have from here to here, it would be 27 inches. And you'd be 16 by 9. So your laptop, if you bought a 27-inch monitor or a 32-inch monitor, all you're doing is taking that laptop screen and making it bigger. So you would see exactly what you see now, but you'd see it in a bigger format, right? But with an ultra-wide, you get these extra pieces. So that would be about 27-inch from there to there. So you get about half a 27 on each side. So if I took these two bits here and put these together you're getting about half a 27 inch monitor extra so you would see what you see now but bigger but you would also get these extra pieces down here so you would see a bit more cockpit you would see your left mirror you would see a bit more if that makes any sense i would highly recommend for some reason if you definitely go on one monitor uh, and you're not going triple screen i would highly recommend buying an ultra wide honestly this little bad boy right what would you recommend for your first monitor whatever you can afford mate right gz how you doing buddy hope you're well class coming out ss i don't know if you go on the steam store it should tell you mate info sorry for no you don't need to apologize we're, we're all here to help mate honestly but i i, I worry because you can get a, a reasonable 27 inch monitor for say 150 pounds but an ultra wide is quite a bit more but honestly if it was me 35 inch ultra wide is what i'd be buying best value for money out there 100 percent uh, you can buy it from any company though so i think samsung do one asus do one i'm pretty sure uh, msi do one now uh, so yeah there's loads of different ones out there lg obviously do 35s lg also do a 38 which is beautiful, uh, which again is more money. So it all depends how much you want to spend money, mate. Main thing is, how much do you want to spend? Right, uh, 
is the wheel easier to use than it? Oh yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Way easier than the controller, yes. Right, so we're going to clean this field, and then we're going to move on to the next field. Uh, I am on uh, Peterville. Uh, it is in the title. Uh, it's it's a really really good map, mate. I absolutely love this map. This fork freaked out again. Ah, I don't know what's going on with this fork at the moment. Right, to be honest, we're not going to be on this that much longer. I've only got about 15 20 minutes left, so we'll just get cracked on. I'll clear this field next time. I'll need to fix that mod. Yeah, that that's my monitor. Uh, but as I say, there is some like Aces monitors are stunning. Uh, so you've got Asus, you've got obviously Samsung monitors are really, really good as well. So honestly, there's some really good monitors out there. So you don't need to buy the one that I've got. As much as I love mine, there is some really good ones out there. Curved is even nice as well. It all depends what he wants to spend Firefight, to be honest. Right, I uh, saw so Super Ultra Wide and Curry's the other day. Uh, yeah, yeah, they are nice. Super Ultra Wides is something I would definitely tell someone to go for if they don't want to have the... Like, someone like Rob. If Rob went triple screen, he wouldn't be able to get in his rig, which would be no good to him. A Super Wide's probably going to be too wide for him as well, but the Ultra Wide is perfect for him. I know it is. It's the same when he came to me about his rig, same to me when he came to me about his, uh, his wheel, you know. So I know he does want to get a shifter, though. So... I don't know if he's uh, still thinking about getting the shifter, but yeah, shifter's good. Yeah, so the, see, the Aces one's really expensive. If you look at the LG one, it is a lot cheaper. It's not as good. It's not as good as the Aces. It really isn't, but... Uh, yeah, the, yeah, there's a few. I can have a quick look for you now, actually. Right, hang on. Obviously, you're in uh, you're in euros. I'm in in pounds, but uh, right. So ultra wide. So yeah, you got the Samsung LS34. Uh, that's three hundred and thirty pounds. You got the LG. That's no good to you. So yeah, you got. There's a couple of Samsung ones. So we got got the LG the LG 34 uh, is 270 pounds. That's cheap. That's a good buy. Uh, you got the Asus Rog Strix 35. Here is so on Amazon. That's a bloody good deal. So on Amazon, the 35 inch Asus Strix at the moment for for us is reduced from 800 to 600 which is really really good so yeah there's a there's a whole load of different types uh, but yeah L the LG and the Samsung ones are definitely cheaper uh, definitely definitely cheaper you, you only want 1080p as well don't forget you don't need to go for uh, a lot bigger than that it's you just you know 1080p because your laptop won't run much higher than that I wouldn't imagine Yeah, just seeing that, that 35 inch ultra wide from Asus is, that's cheap, man. Hey, it's not cheap, don't get me wrong, but, uh, you know. Uh, Kevin, uh, cheers, buddy. You, you don't need to, mate. I've got Windows keys, honestly. I won't use it, mate. You take that back, because I've got Windows keys. But I appreciate the, uh, the gesture, Kevin. I just haven't registered it because... It winds people up. But I, I have got Windows 10 Pro keys, so.
Right, what wheel? I'm using the uh, Logitech Heavy Bundle, which is a farm sim bundle. Yep, 5M is 8pm tonight. It is indeed. Yeah, we're just uh, we're gonna get a little bit more done on it. Won't be a full length stream today because I, I've I've got other stuff I need to get set up for, so uh, a little bit behind on on things today. Sure, want the shifter, but first I thought a bigger screen and the stand for it I can do without. Yeah, I would agree. No, I would agree. After seeing your setup, how far it's come, your biggest thing is you you're missing a decent screen, but. What what sort of euro price are you thinking of spending, uh, Rob? Like in seriousness, I mean, is it the f three four hundred euros you were thinking about, uh, or were you wanting even cheaper than that? Because you'd be able, to, you might be able to get a thirty two inch cheaper, but you're not going to gain any extra from that. Yeah, the guy, you just gotta see how the days pan out, really, mate, to be honest. Right, uh, I haven't tried to set that up yet. What's that, Mark? Uh, I missed what Mark was saying. Hiya, Tina, how are you doing? Hope you're well. Right, no, the stand is about 170 euros, and I was thinking about, yeah, 400 euros, so go and have a look for, have you got Amazon, Rob? You must have Amazon over there. If you've got Amazon, just type in uh, 34 inch and then ultra wide into Amazon and tell me what comes up. Asks, right, someone asking why I don't, why I'm not got subscribers and that on Twitch. It's because Twitch have a rule that if you if you're affiliated or you're partnered, you can't uh, you can't stream on any other platforms. So I don't want to do that yet. So if Twitch picks up in the future, I might do. But at the moment, I don't I don't need to. So. Hiya Nathan Reeves, how are you pal? I'm I'm spot on mate. Can't can't complain my friend. Can't complain. Uh, no problem. I love G27. They're uh, great, man. G27's not bad. Uh, you know, it's it's a good starting wheel. I mean, the best wheel you can get is the one you've got at the end of the day. So, yeah, hundred percent, hundred percent, man. Right, uh, where else are we? I'm very good to pop uh, down to the army on Thursday. Oh, awesome, man. That's good to hear, pal. That is good to hear. Dad's looking for a joystick. Uh, I mean, depending on how much you want to spend, these are the best things to buy. Uh, you can get them secondhand off uh, eBay or Amazon. Uh, Amazon Warehouse is where I got mine. Well, not this one, but my dad's I got from Amazon Warehouse. It was £45 uh, with some wa warranty, which is brilliant. Uh, and it was boxed. It looks brand new. But for me, this is your best bet. It's plug and play. 
plug it in and it just works. It's brilliant. Mum's top. What? The blue top? Well, white top, technically. How are you doing, mate? I hope you're well, bud. Yeah, don't get me wrong, you can get joysticks and things and you can make them work, is how I used to do it, but honestly, after owning this, it's so good. Uh, and everything just works on it, you know, it's built for the game, like. Uh, if you want to get a joystick cheaper than £45, at the end of the day, the joystick's not going to be very good either. So, it would do the job though, there's some cheap Logitech ones that would do the job for about £15-£20, but this is plug and play and it just, it just works so well, you know. Right, we're done boys. We're rolled up and we're done. Oh, you're meeting a mortgage advisor soon. Oh, interesting man. You're buying your own house, are you? Pretty cool. Cool to hear. So, the wheel, the wheel's not the best. You know, it's a, lot, it's a bit, it's a bit, a bit flimsy but to be fair it works great obviously you get the spring back from it which is brilliant but one of the biggest things with it is it's got joysticks and that on the wheel as well so you can look around in the cab uh, you know you can get out the cab all the buttons just work straight out the box you can walk around you know you, you can literally do everything straight off the box off, off the back when I look around your tractor do everything holding it uh, but even your horn, you know, horn's where it should be. But with this, this doesn't feel plasticky at all. This thing's like solid as a rock. Everything, the joystick and everything, it feels brilliant. Obviously, you can use it for your view, or if you press this button, it disables that. And then you can use this for your telehandler and, and, and all that. So if I jump in a telehandler now, obviously, I can use that. For the telehandler up and down, if I press this button, it disables the telehandler and puts it back to being your view. Uh, and then press that button again, and obviously you've got your telehandler again. And everything just works straight off the cuff, which is just brilliant. Ah, season's in for testing. Awesome, man. That's good to hear. Uh, you'll be able to join... Oh, that's good to hear, Kyle. I like that, mate. You're going to be an hour 5M server. Well, as long as you're 18, mate, you're good to go. Uh, Lewis, to be brutally honest, I just enjoy farming on here. Everything just feels good. The wheel feels a good height. Uh, the, the, the control part, like, everything's just a hand. Uh, and to be honest, I think it, the streams look good for it as well, to be honest. But it's completely up to you guys, you know, if you want to see me farm on my rig, I don't mind farming on my rig. Uh, I can't really fit the side panel on my rig, is, is one, of the, one of the things, but I can certainly farm on, on, me, on my big rig if you want me to, but I just, I like farming on here. It's so comfortable. Oh, this old New Holland's brilliant, man. Right, calling it a day there. I'll be back in around about half an hour-ish. Uh, between uh, four and half four, I'm going to be doing some truck building. So there'll be no truck driving today. I'm going to get myself set up on my rig, and we're going to do some truck modifications uh, on my rig so I'll see you all on there on ETS for a truck building stream have a good day take care everyone thanks again don't forget uh, to give us a follow on Twitch if you're on Twitch and a sub on YouTube if you want to see more uh, and I'll catch you all probably in about half an hour 40 minutes take care have a good one.